Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Destiny and today I'm going to be doing a review on the coils in Paradise Line. So um, I basically have everything except for the oil. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and start off with the Clarifying Kaolin Shampoo Bar. And you know, it's kind of hot in my room so this does feel a little soft so I hope it's not too messy. But I'm going to go ahead and wash my hair and then I'm going to come back. Alright, I will be back. I just rinsed that conditioner out. This, this is hours later. <laughs> By the way, if you can't tell, but I just rinsed that conditioner out and spoiler alert, I love it. I absolutely love it. It is, wow. I am, <laughs> I'm truly impressed. Like, truly impressed. So it is the next day and you know <laughs> didn't get a chance uh, well I didn't feel like doing it last night uh, so I'm about to go ahead and apply the styling cream huh. it looks like it kind of didn't absorb all the way in so that's unfortunate huh I don't know about that one y'all about that y'all it kind of looks like it's almost gonna um what you call it flake all right you guys so these are the final results it's the next day and i took my hair out a few hours ago this is how it came out i think so i am actually really liking the result what is that mope okay but yeah, I'm really liking the results. I think, you know, we, we, <laughs> we got a winner on our hands, y'all. So let me give y'all the tea, the milk, and the honey on this collection. So let's start off with the soap bar. This is how I, I'm storing it, I guess. Um, this soap bar was actually really good. Like, my hair felt clean, but it didn't feel stripped. And, but it felt really clean. Like, it felt really clean, but not stripped. But it didn't feel like there was any residue or product buildup on my hair. It felt really good. And this has like a like a fresh, familiar scent. Like I've definitely smelled it in a hair product before. I don't know what it is, but it smells fresh. When you put, like when you're actually washing it and you put water, it does have more of a spice to it, I smell. I don't know. But I give this a four and a half out of five stars. The thing that I don't like is, I've never used a shampoo bar before and it does feel like it's gonna break in the middle. I don't know if you can tell, but like right here, it's kinda like worn more than on the sides and that wasn't intentional. I don't really know why that happened. It does feel like it's gonna break. Um, it's very soft too, like if you, can you see it? If you like do this, like it's gonna leave like if you just apply a little bit of pressure it's gonna leave a dent in the soap so it lathers very well but like i said the only thing i don't like is i feel like it's gonna break the next time or maybe the time after that that i use it it does feel like it's gonna break and it can become messy especially if you're not in the shower and i don't wash my hair in the shower so i had to put it like on a paper towel i think i put it on and it was kind of getting stuck to it so it's a little annoying but i really like this if they come up with another shampoo and they have it as a cream no, I'm picking it up. Okay, so I would definitely repurchase this. Um, it does seem like I'm going to be able to get a few uses out of here. So that I was a little worried at first because, you know, it is only four ounces. So, but it seems like you can get some uses out of this as long as it will stay together and not be all, you know, crumbly. So, yeah, four and a half out of five stars now. Y'all. This deep conditioner, this deep conditioner, honey, 
this is it this right here <laughs> let me make sure you see you see it that's what it's called honey this is the truth this this is how a deep conditioner is supposed to feel like in general not just like a protein moisture balance just in general like this is how much i used this is what it looks like i used a lot actually this is 12 ounces too so i'm glad it's 12 ounces because you know i'm <laughs> I, did, I, put my, I, part my, I parted my hair in five sections instead of my usual four and I do feel like that made me use a lot more than usual but girl this is worth it this is let me tell you let me just tell you I me, okay in case you haven't noticed if you haven't seen none of my hauls I pay full price for any product I've never paid full there's not one product in my stash that I've paid full price for that didn't come from the beauty supply store if it came from the beauty supply store, of course. But even at my beauty supply store, they got a little rewards program, honey. So <laughs> I'm not paying full price. My hair felt so strong and perfectly balanced. Like it felt strong, but moisturized and hydrated. Like it felt even after it dried, my hair still felt the same way as it did when I was rinsing it out. And it just felt perfectly balanced. Like with this one, I would. I would buy a full price and full price is $18.99 it's not cheap okay but it's definitely worth it it's worth every bit of full price what I can say if you're not a fan of hibiscus like the scent this might get on your nerves because it does kind of linger I mean it'll linger until you apply your styling products but it's pretty it's kind of strong next I used the uh, Shore and Sweet Almond Oil Leave-In Conditioner and that's about how much that I use. There you go. So with this one, so first and foremost, I'm going to give it a 4 out of 5. As soon as I rinsed the conditioner out, I applied this on wet hair and I just put it in a braid because y'all y'all probably saw in the previous clip i did my hair the next day and you know i just felt like it didn't absorb all the way into my hair and it um it kind of sat on top because the next day when i unraveled the braid to start twisting it it was still some residue on top of my hair it didn't like flake or anything like that because like i could just rub it in but like i said I was already rubbing it in so it should have just absorbed but it didn't but it's still a good product i feel like it works well with the styling cream like i feel like these pair well together but this wasn't as moisturizing as i needed it to be and like i said i don't like how it kind of just sat on top of my hair even though my hair was wet even though i let it like it's a day later at this point so that like if you're gonna try from the line and you want to purchase like you know thing i mean it's only they only have like six products i think so if you wanted to try all of these i definitely would especially if they're on sale because you know i got them 50 percent off when i got 50 percent off my order i would still um try them together so the next day after i put this on you know i still need to test this out really honestly i'm gonna test this out i might use it with a different styler or something like that but i still need to test it out as of right now it's a four out of five next thing i used was the mango and mephora styling cream and you know it's an odd color it's like a greenish tint to it i don't know if that's picking up but it's like a greenish tint to it and you know this has a lot of slip where'd it go <laughs> this has a lot of slip and i find it to be moisturizing i do feel like my hair is pretty defined i mean some spots let me just tell y'all if y'all haven't already noticed I don't really know how to do hair like that. I just do what I do to my head and that's all I know. I love products though. Like I'm a product junkie, but I don't really know how to style hair like that. So, <laughs> you know, if I could get a decent look with a styler, then I'm pretty satisfied. Cause like, I know I can't do hair, but um, I feel like I got pretty good definition with this one. Um, my hair, it's not, it's not hard but it's not as soft as it could be and this isn't the type of cast that comes from like a gel it's not that kind of hard it's like like this is i could feel the proteins working and this does have rice bran oil the leave-in does have rice bran oil in it and i don't know if that's i feel like that's probably got some 
protein in it and I'm not sure on how my hair feels fares with protein in a styler in a leave-in anything past the deep conditioning process I don't know how my hair kind of reacts with that because just with that Myel Myel honey um, when I use that rice water collection that moisturizing milk that left my hair hard too but my hair's not hard it's there's some softness to it but I've definitely had softer styles so I think this is pretty good. It has great slip. It defines my natural curl pattern before even twisting. Um, I think it is moisturizing on its own. Um, I do want to try it again with a different leave-in because like I said, I don't think my hair really agree with this leave-in too much like that. But I do like it. I like the definition and I feel like it has pretty good hold. Like I feel like I can get through the week with this hair. And I will. Okay, at first, I was a little nervous because it, when I was applying it, kind of like, I saw some little crumbs, like some little crumbly, started kind of crumbing up, and I'm like, oh, what was that? I thought that it was going to be snowing in July, honey, y'all. I cannot stand when my hair flakes, like, I just feel like I wasted all that time for nothing because now I need to wash my hair out. I don't like seeing a bunch of particles, sediments in my hair, I don't like that. So, I'm really glad I don't have any. If you see anything right here, it's like my edge control edge control of course these edges can't be under control honey what are you talking about <laughs> anyway I don't have any um, residue like let me turn around so yeah I don't have any residue or any crumbs or any particles or anything like that so I'm glad that this did absorb into my hair I'll say that this truly did absorb into my hair but this one it didn't so I, you know what i'm gonna give this a benefit of the doubt i'm gonna say that it wasn't this and i'm gonna give this a four and a half stars um like i said i'm gonna test it with a different leave-in and i think it'll be fine like i probably won't even have any problems with it but yeah i feel like i do feel like this was hydrating and it gave me definition and it gave me some hold so that's really all I can ask for, you know what I'm saying? Well, yeah, if you like this video, give it a like, comment, subscribe, and y'all have a blessed, awesome, amazing, fruitful, beautiful day, okay? Let me see, is there anything else I'm missing? I really enjoyed these products and I would definitely recommend and I will purchase again.